Hi, my name is Dr. Teresa Fossum, and I decided to become a veterinarian at a very early age. I grew up on a ranch. We raised cattle and quarter horses, and so I knew when I was five or six that I wanted to pursue veterinary medicine as a career. Pet Industry, la comunidad de los empresarios, gerentes y profesionales de la industria de mascotas. I didn't know nearly as early that I wanted to be a surgeon that I knew that I wanted to be a veterinarian. So it wasn't until I did my internship and started doing surgery that I fell in love with it and decided that's what I wanted my career to be. So it's been my honor to provide lectures here in Cali. I'm speaking about respiratory distress and how to manage those animals. Animals that present with acute abdomens, uh, gastric dilatation volvulus, and intestinal surgery, how to reduce morbidity and mortality. So we tend to use a lot of opioids for pain management, although with new regulations it is getting harder to get opioids, sometimes they're back ordered, not available. And so we are always looking for alternatives. Uh, we do know that lidocaine mixed with opioids may actually increase survival in some diseases. So for example, reperfusion injury, I mentioned in my talk. Um, but we are looking at new things such as uh, CBD, the cannabinoids, to try and find natural ways to manage pain in our post-operative patients, as well as just in our patients in general. I mentioned in one of my talks that studies would suggest that we probably use antibiotics for longer than we need. In one study in humans, they showed that people that were on antibiotics for four days did as well as people who were on antibiotics for eight days. So we probably don't need to give them for a couple weeks, probably could shorten that time Exactly what the time is, we don't really know because the studies haven't been done, but five to seven days may be more than adequate. So I'd like to extend my greetings to all the veterinarians in Colombia, and I'd like to just say that it's a beautiful country and the people are fabulous. It's been my pleasure and my honor to be here. Pet Industry, la comunidad de los empresarios, gerentes y profesionales de la industria de mascotas.